And check this out. A Jeep blazing down a residential street. It flies through the air and crashes into a woman's home. And that homeowner says everyone involved is lucky to be alive tonight. 13 Action News reporter Gina Lazara is live in front of the woman's home near Nellis Ann Owens with this crazy story. Gina? Christopher, that homeowner was on her way to work when her neighbor called to tell her an SUV went through her wall into her kitchen after that Jeep was literally airborne. Check this out. No more than five seconds after this car turns right, this Jeep takes off into the air, bouncing off the ground three times before smashing into Pam Delzer's home, causing this huge plume of dust. Honestly, I hopped out and I said, who the F did this? Pam was on her way to work when her neighbor called her and told her to turn around. Oh my God, a car's in Pam's house. So I ran out here barefoot and sure enough, you could still see dust flying and there was a vehicle in this backyard here. Pam and Jenny say the driver of that Jeep was arguing with her boyfriend while speeding down Monroe Ave. The ladies say police told them she was doing 90 in a 25. She's lucky she's alive. Neighbors rushed over to the scene. Then Pam arrives. Hi, welcome to my backyard. <laughs> and sees the damage. This is part of her vehicle. <laughs> Pam and Jenny say the intersection used to be a four-way stop years ago. And they do up to 90, and they won't put the stop signs back in. But now, Pam says, these crashes happen regularly. Thank God nobody died. Nobody died. My animals are safe. My animals are not dead. You know, I have to live inconveniently. That's nothing compared to what could have happened. Back out here live, I'm told the driver of that Jeep had just minor in injuries. Once she was able to get out of her Jeep, she was able to walk herself to the ambulance, which is definitely a good sign. Reporting live tonight, Gina Lazara, 13 Action News. Thank you, Gina.